Hello friends. In this video, we are going to be discussing about Java Lang out of memory error, direct buffer memory. Friends, as we discussed in the earlier video, there are nine different types of out of memory error. The seventh type of out of memory error is direct buffer memory. Friends, in the JVM memory region, there is a region called direct buffer. And when this region gets saturated, and then there's no more room to create additional objects in this region, that's when you are going to confront this Java Lang out of memory error, direct buffer memory, right? And this problem is getting pervasive and more in the Spring Boot frameworks. Let's discuss about that briefly. Okay. So let's look at a demo, how this can happen, right? So here is a simple program, an hypothetical program that I put together, which is going to trigger this problem. Look what I'm doing. Here I'm trying to allocate a byte buffer which is a java nio right i'm using this java native io api byte buffer i'm trying to create an object whenever you create an object uh, using this nio those are created in this direct buffer region and if there's not sufficient memory there then you're going to get you're going to confront this problem java lang out of memory error direct buffer memory let me run this program okay you see i ran now I got this Java Lang out of memory error, direct buffer memory. See, we got this error. And this is a very great indicator. One, it's very easy to see where this problem is happening, right, to diagnosis. Whenever this problem happens, you can see it's going to be printed in the stack trace. So look into your, uh, when this happens, if the developer is catching it and writing it to the log file, look into the log file. Or if it's sent to the error stream, look into the error stream it clearly shows a stack trace where the problem is originating. You can see it is originating in this OOM direct buffer. This is my class on this line number. So it is very easy to see the origination point to see where the leak is happening. Okay. So what causes this Java Lang out of memory direct buffer memory? When there is an increase in the consumption, of uh, memory in this direct buffer region or when there is a leak in the direct buffer memory region you are going to have this error what are what are the causes for that say suppose if you are using java nio package and you are trying to do uh, create over create objects there you will get it and friends what has happened uh, the spring they are spring boot framework they are recommending to move from rest template to use web client so this is a uh, apis we use to service our REST APIs, right? They are asking to move the web client. And when you start to move the web client, the web clients are creating the objects in this direct buffer region. Whereas the REST template API, we are not creating the objects in this uh, direct buffer region. So when you upgrade, you are now starting to create object in this direct buffer region. And if there's not sufficient memory for that region, you are going to confront this error. And let's say if you start to do uh, a lot of image processing a native io processing if you started a lot of uh, those things then also you're going to confront this error okay? so what are the solutions to this problem first solution is check to see whether there's any legitimate memory leak is happening like look in the stack trace right which was we were showing the stack trace here or showing where it is happening so here we, what i'm doing is i'm trying to get a very large size max value integer max value it's a very large object this no developer creates such a max value uh here so it's clearly a bug i'm introduced here to see whether it is a bug because of our code it is happening if so fix it the second solution is you can increase your direct buffer memory region size by passing this argument xss max direct memory size increase it see you're setting it to 200 mb Make it as 300 MB or 400 MB. Okay. And also, friends, other thing, they have done, the JVM developers have done a lot of optimizations in Java 17 uh, to uh, so that you can process more requests with the same region, but uh, in Java 17. So here is a, a blog post that we have written. I will share the link. Here is a white paper where we show the optimizations comparing the performance of Java 11 and 17. Here, what we are trying to do is, here we have the sample program. We are trying to uh, post an image in process of the Java NIO API. You can see in Java 11, we were confronting this uh, out of memory error, direct buffer memory, 
after just processing like the 14 images whereas that very same program when it's run in java 17 it was able to go till 49 uh, processing it was able to process like a 49 images so the J jvm developers have made optimizations to process more uh, objects in in the direct buffer memory region so if you happen to be running on java 11 or below versions consider upgrading it so that it's more effectively processing is happening there and okay, so what are the artifacts that you need uh, to troubleshoot this you need to use application log or standard error right and also you can also use this native memory tracking i will talk about this in another video where it shows which region of your jv memory is growing right if you see this direct buffer to be growing that's a clean indication that the problem is happening here okay okay friends thank you very much i'll meet you in yet another interesting video thank you